Hello, hello. Hello, hello. All right, let's start with removing this bot from the meeting. So. With a, a moment, see if we have any other joiners today. All right, um, let's, let's kick it off. So I'm sharing my screen and uh, just in case, just to be consistent, I'll still uh, display our uh, Hyperledger and HRS policy notice. All right, so um, let's get into it. Um, so for the start meeting discussion, um, I copy pasted these points from the last week. Uh, there's not much of updates here, but I believe uh, I believe that uh, well, we can actually take a look. Um, so the mentorship program. Uh, I should be able to find some links. I was posting previously. Where could it be? Um, well, it's a little bit difficult. Oh, there we go. There we go. So let's see if there's any update. Uh, if our uh, project proposals uh, got approved. Uh, nevertheless, yeah, the proposal review timeline goes till today, so it should be completed by today. And let's try to see if there's any uh, upgrade uh, updates on our particular project. Um, but no, they are all still pending review, so no updates here. I guess we'll have uh, more uh, news next week. Uh, just a short, good first issue review. So uh, of the review of this initiative. So I think there was no new good issues created. Uh, nevertheless, the, the two issues uh, are which uh, our contributors have picked up are still ongoing. Plus, uh, I know there's one more person who's now picking up uh, this uh, testing task. Uh, to write some unit tests. So I guess we should be expecting some PR. Um, well, and that, that's for this. Uh, so let's move to the overview of the recent work. So we have finally uh, merged uh, the, the new brand new messages created. That was a huge, huge effort. Uh, lots of comments on this and lots of commits especially lots of time and hard work. Uh, so this is done and uh, uh, it's not being yet used. It's not yet integrated within the code base, but uh, it's ready for being used. So great, yeah, great. just uh, want to note uh, that this was a great job. Uh, Bogdan, <clears throat> really nice. 
Yeah, the integration is in progress. A uh, bit of a pain in the neck, but that's how these things go. Um, and there's no PR just yet. There is a branch, I created a branch, but I didn't make a PR yet, um, especially because there's like, this kind of has to be a, like all or nothing kind of thing. So um, I'll basically make the PR once everything is uh, integrated and you can remove the messages, like the old messages, great. Um, maybe just a, as a note in terms of how the integration is going, so it's like this isn't necessarily something that uh, we will, I don't know, maybe I'm not choosing the right words, but not necessarily something that we'll be particularly proud of. It's more about retrofitting this so that we can actually start refactoring their CCX as well and the state machines and everything else. So just that we have a consistent approach. Uh, and you know that you and I have been discussing about this, that it is annoying that, and maybe I would sometimes feel like it would be better off just to start from scratch, but that would also be a great effort and we would end up with trades and stuff. And it's definitely not a good approach either. So there doesn't really seem to be an easy way uh, to go about it, but uh, we'll stick with this uh, retrofitting um, and just ensuring that everything still works as it used to before and then we can move on to better stuff and refine the RTCS. Yeah, I see, I see. And thank you for update. Uh, just wondering, would you mind to uh, push, like uh, publish the branch you have? It will be maybe- It is published. Uh, it's published, it's just not uh, in, it's just not a PR. It's not a PR. Yeah, uh, there's no PR on it. Um, and I guess the main reason why I didn't make a PR from it's because I don't want to keep canceling the uh, the CI stuff. Uh, right. As I said, because things are not really uh, working right now since I'm in progress with uh, replacing the messages. Mm -hmm. Great. So um, until everything until it gets replaced everywhere, the CI is just going to fail. Anyway. Yeah, maybe uh, maybe I'm thinking. Like uh, maybe I'm thinking like that's a good point. Like uh, because it is it is annoying to like cancel it all the time if you push a lot, and. Uh, Maybe we could make a, a tag similar, like we have some uh, yeah, maybe for in or the something. CI. So we could make a, a kind of a tag, like skip CI entirely. And then you mm -hmm. could perhaps create a PR as a draft. And uh, like, I would personally appreciate it because then I could see like, you know, diff right. very easily. And like, see if, if I'm changing something, I could easily see like, oh, if I do this, uh, we're going to run into conflicts. Maybe I shouldn't change this part right now, you know? Fair enough. All right. Uh, so we can do like a small CI uh, upgrade. I'll just note it here. So uh, we kind of go ahead of ourselves, but it's fine. Uh, create CI, create stack to skip CI. Um, so yeah, that was the messages to create. Uh, now continuing in the overview, uh, yeah, we have merged these uh, guidelines, which we've been discussing actually on like our previous two calls so far, and then a little bit uh, more on the PR review of this document. So it's a number of uh, main kind of ideas uh, which we should follow when we implement uh, state machines going forward. I'm not going to go over it again because that will be the third time and we already covered it. It's here uh, for every, any, anyone to read. So just leave it at, at this. Um, going forward, uh, that was a small refactoring from myself around uh, the profile layer of VCX where we uh, which separates the the underlying libraries from the like Aries business logic. So that was just some refactorings uh, in that area, but nothing significant. No no changes of logic or anything like that. Um, 
Uh, next up, yeah, there was uh, two more PRs merged from Miroslav, from Miro. Uh, and those were about, uh, about the approach we were previously taking in our Node.js artifacts, where we uh, declare peer dependencies and kind of uh, misuse them in a way. So here, uh, Miro is uh, Mirgi is explaining the way uh, the, the, the stuff we changed. And basically, uh, it's it's uh, changing the package JSONs, uh, package JSON files and declarations for our Node.js uh, artifacts we are publishing. Um, yeah. And then uh, that's pretty much it as for the work we've done uh, since the last meeting. Um, yeah, then we have a check on progress. We already uh, touched on this. Uh, Bogdan is busy now integrating the new messages created into Aries UCX. We'll create uh, the job for skipping CI. So this, this ongoing work can be visible as a draft PR. Um, and then, yeah, we have also this, uh, this refactoring going on from St Stevane. Uh, so has been a review uh, going back and forth. There's still some uh, pending items here to be addressed, but nevertheless, once this is uh, this is done, I think it'll be a nice nice improvement uh, around the issuer uh, portion, issuer side in particular, creating the encoding credential values. Uh, that should that should not pose any like significant like risk in terms of conflicts as uh, that's that's pretty much uh, separated from the all of the state machine stuff so even if uh, if uh, someone starts doing some state machine refactoring it shouldn't uh, significantly collide with this refactoring uh, yeah, and I think that's that's uh, that's it as for what's going on right now. Um, um, there's a upcoming work, so obviously <clears throat> uh, the messages integration that's gonna take a while, and then yeah, we have the state pattern refactoring pending. Uh, kind of open question is if uh, and it's it's kind of uh, it's too bad that uh, George is not here today because. I had one one thing to uh, discuss uh, with George, um, in terms of uh, whether or whether we should not uh, try to align the existing state machines, at least partially, with those um, state machine guidelines uh, we have put together. So I actually have a, a PR completed not PR, a branch completed where I've modified uh, the holder, a state, ex the existing holder state machine such that it doesn't have any sent states. I removed a bunch of, um, bunch of IO from the state machine and pulled it up onto the handler layer. Uh, but then uh, at the same time, I know, it, so it was kind of an exercise for me just to see maybe how difficult it would be. And it wasn't, but at the same time, uh, George has uh, open uh, PR where he already started rewriting the state machine into the type state pattern, although it's separate. Uh, and I guess there's like, this will yet to be kind of reworked because it doesn't follow those guidelines yet. It has these sent states uh, and therefore I assume it also contains IO. But yeah, I'm just not quite sure if I should, uh, if we should be uh, um, doing the work. Actually, I would deeply appreciate if we wouldn't be merging stuff into our DCX right now, unless like- it's Yeah, and that's necessary. the second thing, exactly. So that I can finalize this messages integration because if things change, then I have to change things as well. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> ends up being with like, a lot of conflicts. 
Yeah, yeah. Was, you, you were the second on my mind also. I mean, I know that you'll be having deltas all over the place, so I don't want to make it um, more more difficult than it already has to be. Yeah, it's so already I'll, I'll just hold back. I, I have that branch. Maybe I'll, I'll like, uh, maybe I'll, I'm, I might use it later, may turn it into PR after after messages integration. We'll see. Also, we'll see what uh, like George or uh, other people's opinions are on this. So I'll just hold back for now. Um, um, and yeah, I guess that's kind of it. Um, kind of covered everything. It was a short one. Uh, the end meeting discussion. Yeah, I already touched on this uh, just now. And I personally don't have anything else to discuss today. Any any items on on your side, Bogdan? Nope, not really. All right, then uh, it was a quick one today. Just uh, went through, ran through the agenda, got a couple of updates. Uh, busy with work, so we we all, we both have uh, forty minutes of our time back to our day. So let's let's leverage it. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah, thank you. Cheers.